So we are going to do some more pumpkin carving, but this time I am going to design it for a cricket in my cricket design space. Cricket's a craft cutter. Some people have cameos. You can cut different vinyls. You can cut paper, cardstock, food box, cardboard. So think about the things you might want to make for that. We're talking stickers, window clings, um, iron-ons. Stuff you're going to put on a bulletin board or on your door. Things you could hang or things you could just tape up or, sta or staple up kind of idea. I like to get SVGs. Most softwares deal well with SVGs. I use two websites, flaticon.com, to get me some SVGs. Most of them are free. Some are premium. I avoid the premiums. They just want attribution. I also use Silhouette Garden. Again, they're mostly free, and they just want attribution. So I've already downloaded some and uploaded to my um, Cricut software. So we're going to get this pumpkin going in here. So I click on my pumpkin, and I insert image. Bam, there comes my pumpkin. Let's make this bigger. Full. All right, so um, if you want to hang it, you, we got to put a ring on it somewhere, and I'll, I'll just do that first. So I need to get a couple of circles. And I'm just going to copy and paste one, make it a little smaller. There are two tools that are really going to be your friend. I'll make it even smaller. Um, and that's going to be the weld and the slice tool. Um, so those are down on the bottom right, depending on what you've got selected. So I'm trying to select those two circles. Basically, I want to slice out um, part of the circle. So no, it looks like nothing happened, except over here it says there's a slice. So there's my slice. And now here are two pieces. This was the original circle, and this is the slice that I cut out. Those I can delete. Now that slice is a little big. Again, you can always resize. I want to stick it on my pumpkin. And now I want to also select the pumpkin. And now I want to weld those two together. There we go. So now I got a little loop to hang that from. Hang that by. Okay. So there's weld. Merges things together. We might play with that later. Now I want to cut eyes and stuff. So I'm going to get some shapes, put them on here, adjust some sizes. Now, slicing only works between two objects. So I'm just going to do one at a time. There's an eye, so I've got the eye selected. Select the pumpkin. Slice. Pull my slices out. Delete my slices. So there's no sense in me, you know, adding more stuff on here. I might could have, but again, you you can only select them one pairs at a time. So now I'm going to select the pumpkin, which is that pumpkin slice, and my pentagon. And again, it looks like nothing happened until you pull those things out and delete them. And I haven't figured out how to put best put a mouth in here. Other than overlapping some stuff, um, let's put an octagon nose. Again, we're going to slice. I'm going to so I need to so one thing's already selected. I need to select the other. So I hit shift and then select, so I can select two. But if I only have two things there, I could probably just you know control all, command all, delete them. Uh, I'm not going to bother with, with the mouse. That's going to take. But what I'm thinking for the mouth is to mash up um, mash up some things. Put some, some diamonds together or something. I wonder if I could group these. That's a good question. I don't know if I can do that. Can I, I don't want to group everything. I just want to see if I can group these together. And I know I can group them, groups up here. And then I just wonder if they, uh, I should probably just weld them together. 
There we go. And now we can adjust size. And if I change this lock over here, I could probably, yeah, stretch it out. Hey, this might actually work. Because now I was wondering if it would actually, yeah, but it's still going to be a little bit big. I don't get the curve anymore. All right, and let's see if I can slice this. Ooh, it said yes. Ta-da! So that's going to cut out um, for the on the Cricut. Again, food box cardboard, nice to work with. Different vinyls, paper, cardstock, stickers, iron-ons, window clings. Now, again, we can add stuff to the pumpkin or whatever shape you're doing. I already uploaded wings. Now, let me show you something here, though, what you need to be looking for. Um so there's these wings and if we were to i need to what how do i i gotta get rid of it oh ungroup them let's do that yeah all right and then i want to copy and paste that one i didn't like the other one because it was open and we're gonna flip Okay, so that's how that would do. We would, you know, ungroup it. We would flip, copy, paste it, flip it. Now here's the here's the thing. Now again, I can just I can weld. This thing will weld, right? Select both the two things I want to weld, and click weld, and boom. But there's this opening in here that's actually going to get cut out. Now, if you want that to happen, that's fine. But I kind of I don't I'm not gonna, I don't like that with that. So I'm going to undo that. And I'm going to get rid of this kind of wing and bring in that other one I had, which was a solid filled shape. Okay, so again, what do I got to do? Oh, I got to ungroup this. That's up in the top right. And I need to. Ooh, this came in different parts. Oh, okay, yeah, I'm going to get rid of that. Ooh, maybe I still can ungroup that. Okay. All right? Yeah. All right, so because it's solid, let's see, stick this one here, stick this one over here. I'm going to Command A, Control A if you're on Windows, and then I'm going to weld them because we can weld multiple things. Slice, you can only do two things. And there we go. So that's going to cut out the shape where the other one's going to have some inner things cut. And now again, if you don't like the size, click on it, grab cor grab that corner. If you want to change the proportionality, you have to uncheck the box, uncheck the lock. And I can make this a tall, skinny pumpkin. Yeah, whatever you want to do. And then I go to make it. And there's my pumpkin. Enjoy. Now I just got to find the, get back to, there we go, stop sharing.